the uh, president um, and I have uh, uh, had a what I believe to be a, a very important discussion on the problem of um, acid rain. Uh, we have made a a significant step forward uh, in that a matter that has been on the back burner really for the last three years has now been brought up forward and I think uh, on both sides we acknowledge the that our problem is common in nature and requires a joint solution. So the President and I uh, will be talking about this uh, again tomorrow and in the future, but I think uh, uh, that we have managed to uh, break a deadlock which has uh, prevented some common action on this. From the Canadian point of view, uh, as you know, I've taken the, the position that it's important that we clean up our own act, and Canada has uh, begun that process with a comprehensive national program. Um, and so there will be a document released, um, I suppose, within the next half hour or so. Uh, but to ensure that this matter, this, this matter that the President and I both agree uh, is of such great importance to our respective countries, uh, to ensure that this never finds its way again onto the back burner, uh, we have agreed today to the appointment of uh, two uh, special envoys uh, of uh, great excellence and influence and uncommon access uh, to us as, as leaders. Uh, and they will carry the matters forward and I think uh, help us achieve uh, real results. They'll report to us on a regular basis. And I appreciate the President's commitment as demonstrated by the caliber of uh, his appointment, which he will announce uh, uh, momentarily. For our part, the Government of Canada is particularly pleased to announce the appointment uh, of the Honourable William G. Davis, uh, former Prime Minister of Ontario, uh, as uh, our special ambassador uh, in this uh, vital area. Uh, je pense aujourd'hui que nous avons fait uh, un pas uh, important uh, uh, en avant uh, dans ce dossier des pluies acides. Uh, nous avons commencé le processus de mettre de l'ordre de nos affaires. Uh, nous nous dirigeons, je pense, uh, vers une solution commune. Et il y a une reconnaissance de part et d'autre uh, qu'il y a une origine commune de ce problème, qu'on ne peut pas agir seul, que le sort de nos deux pays uh, sont hautement uh, reliés l'un à l'autre. Donc, uh, uh, le gouvernement du Canada a déjà commencé son propre programme Euh, national dans ce domaine et c'est avec grand plaisir que aujourd'hui euh, afin de s'assurer que jamais plus on retrouve cette question vitale euh, 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 comme euh, parents pauvres de la famille que nous avons désigné de porte d'eau des ambassadeurs euh, euh, personnels de qualité euh, exceptionnelle pour s'assurer que les dossiers Euh, nous soit rapporté en temps opportun et sur une base régulière. Et c'est avec grand plaisir que j'ai eu le plaisir de confirmer à M. le Président la nomination de l'honorable euh, William G. Davis, ancien Premier ministre de la province de l'Ontario. Merci et à M. le Président, à vous la parole. Well, I'll only take a, a second here simply to endorse what the Prime Minister has told you. I'm very pleased with the outcome of the discussion. We touched upon a number of things of interest and we'll be dealing with uh, those in the meetings to come tomorrow. But a uh, particular concern to us was this issue of acid rain. And I am very pleased uh, with the envoys that have been chosen. Uh, the Prime Minister has named a man that I'm sure you all know his access to him and uh, has a standing that will make him uh, capable of carrying out what has to be a joint undertaking, as the Prime Minister has said. And on, for our own part, uh, my nominee, uh, and he has accepted, is Drew Lewis, the former Secretary of Transportation who has agreed to take on this task. And so, together, we'll find an answer to this problem. And I'm, I couldn't be happier uh, 
about getting this underway and off dead center. What are they supposed to do? Uh, we've, we've agreed there'll be no questions, so I can't take your, your question there. But uh, we shall go forward uh, with finding an answer to what is a problem that belongs to both of us. I think the, it's very significant that our two countries should work together on all matters of environment because entrusted to us is the care of a, a very unique continent and a very beautiful continent. And I think all of us share the desire to protect this for generations of Canadians and Americans yet to come. Thank you.